Hi, I'm Diane from Parish Medical, and we're just getting ready to start a screening mammogram on my friend Dana. So here we go. So it's different than what you had in 2002. So this arm down. So I will see the images immediately. Oh, good. So there's no sit here and wait while we have to develop. So these are the newer machines that allow us to see our images almost right when we take them. Yep, that's what it looks like. I'm not Gosh, that seems keep, so funny. I'm not going to let you keep your head. Like this. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. You are really good with the compression. Okay, Dana, doing great. Only two to go. How are you doing? All right? Yep. Machine's going to turn. Okay. Too far enough away. You know, I think I, I, I can remember the first one really hurting. Yeah. But I think since I breastfed, Possible. I've had other patients tell me that. Something about the babies, they uh they take away a little bit of the sensitivity that we are born with. How flat we can make it. Okay, chin up. Don't talk just for a second. Okay, one left. One left. You're doing great. You tolerate the compression really well. Your pictures are gorgeous. The compression is so important. If you can tolerate more compression, you can see better. Okay. It's just so much better. Okay. We try to encourage our patients, but we won't hurt them either. You know, that's why we're, I'm always asking you, are you doing okay? You know, I don't want to scare you into never wanting to do this again. <laughs> Chin up. I don't think the size really matters, you know, okay. and how they tolerate it. You know, it's it's breast size. It really just depends on the woman. Okay. You know how sensitive she is and what type of breast tissue. Sometimes younger patients do feel them a little more because you still have a lot of. So there's more there to make you feel like it hurts as you get older. Sometimes. Now, but that's not for everybody. Everybody's different. Right. Women are so different from each other. Um, once a woman starts at 40, uh -huh. then what do you suggest? Every year? Or? The American Cancer Society mm -hmm. and the American College of Radiology all say every year at the age of 40. Okay. So that's kind of what the two agencies we work for recommend. Okay. And that's how it goes. And even ladies in their age should do it. Really? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now, the key is catching it real early. So you can live more in years. Mm -hmm. If you just leave it alone, well, we know what happens. You know, it usually spreads to other areas, and the prognosis isn't that good. 
but early detection of prognosis has been wonderful. Okay. Anything else? Not yet. I mean, just to uh, see the pictures. Okay. You can see them over here if you like. This is what, what's nice about digital. That is the last picture we took. No, that can go. Yeah, I don't know about that. This is That's your, not sexy. This is your other side. And then, of course, these are the first two, how it looks. And this is digital, so all I do is hit this key, and it is sent to the digital cameras into the radiologist office where he proceeds to read them and give us...